The end of an era for Marine Corps aviation as the last pilot to be trained on the CH-46 takes his check flight. The frog, as it's known, has been transporting combat troops and equipment for more than 50 years. Our Erica Fox takes us along for this historic day in aviation. We're launched at the route, on the route 1345, for a 1500 overhead back here at Camp Pendleton. We're going to head out of here, take the coastline all the way down. Wednesday marking the end of pilot training on the CH-46 Frog as the last pilot to be trained on the helicopter takes the final check ride at Camp Pendleton. Fox 5 riding along. Go around, talk to Lindbergh, North Island, up through the East Bay or the Bay Transition. It's just sad to see it going away, you know, it's eventful, it's been, been around for a long time, so it's good to send it out and one last hurrah, the last pilot ever trained. The entire HMMT-164 taking flight in all 12 frogs to mark the occasion. The CH-46 has taken part in every conflict the Marine Corps has engaged in since 1964. Those who fly it know its reliability and maneuverability. Its size, its versatility, you know, the two big rotors, we can stop on a dime. The CH-46 will be replaced over the next year or two by the V-22 Osprey, which many of these pilots look forward to soon flying. First, it's an honor to be able to fly it because of the history and the legacy behind it. Um, and second, it's also exciting because that means we'll be able to fly something else later on. Right now, we're flying at a couple hundred feet above the ground. We've got 11 other aircraft flying with us. Two pilots up at the front. These gentlemen right here, there's two of them right here. They're on the lookout, checking out for safety hazards for other aircraft. The final check ride for an aircraft that served for more than 50 years. It's been the backbone of the Marine Corps Assault Support Program uh, since about 1966. So that proves that it's a workhorse and that it's done great things for the Marine Corps and the United States as a whole. Aboard the final CH-46 check ride at Camp Pendleton, Erica Fox, Fox 5 News. A